Sarah Evans, hi. Good morning. Good morning. And, you know, good morning. You looked awesome last night. I can't believe you're up this early. And I can't either. Well, I have kids. I'm used to getting up early. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Six kids? You, seven. Se- you have seven in the house? Uh-huh. Oh, my gosh. We have, um, Jay has four and I have three. For some reason, I thought it was six, but no. yeah, it's more than the Brady Bunch. The Brady Bunch was six. We have seven. We have the Brady Bunch plus that cousin Oliver. Remember when he came to live with them? Yeah. That's what we <laughs> yeah, have. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, I remember that. Well, you know, I think I think that we all admire you so much because you do that. And it sounds like you really enjoy being with the kids and family. Oh, yeah. And, and then you can have this really high profile and career that takes so much time. And Yeah, and this has been a, um, a tough year, I'm not going to lie, because it's been a year of, you know, Going out, visiting radio, um, sort of re-entering after the break that I took. And so I've had to, you know, work very, very hard. And um, my family has dealt with it tremendously well. And we're, we're now back to the point where it's normal um, career routine. In other words, you know, we're, we're on the bus. We're touring with Roscoe Flats. The kids go with me, that kind of stuff. So it's great. I mean, it's, it's very manageable and... Um, but it takes a ton of planning. I mean, like, I, I live with a calendar. <laughs> How are you? <laughs> Craig Morgan just came up. I, I didn't even notice. I'm like, taking so the paparazzi out of it. pictures. <laughs> um, good to see you, Craig. <laughs> it's okay. A little prankster. Well, get, get used to pranks because. <laughs> really? You served Craig Morgan with papers? I did, yes. For stalking me. Yes. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. Well, I'm sure you But it did no stalkers. good. <laughs> That's funny. Well, you know, get used to pranks because I guess on the Rascal Flats tour, I was talking to Joe Don Rooney the other day, and he said, yeah, we're bringing along a dunk tank, and watch out, Sarah Evans is going to end up in that dunk tank. Oh, whatever. I will take them down. <laughs> and I'm going to kick their butts in basketball, too. Really? Yeah. You're a basketball player? I'm an athlete. Yes. That's that's what I love to do. If I was not a singer, I would I would probably be in sports somehow. Really? Mm-hmm. What was your sport of choice in high school? Softball. You you know what? You yeah. seem like a softball player. Do I? Yeah. Awesome. Uh, now yeah. that you say that, I still throw, and you know that's that's one of the main workouts that I do. Is Jay will will go out in the football field that's right across the street from our house, which is why we bought the house. And um, he throws me pop flies, and then I just sling them back into him, just one after another. And you would be amazed at the workout that that is. Wow. We've also, as a family, been playing Ultimate Frisbee recently, and that is a phenomenal workout. All you do is run. Yeah, that is good. Mm -hmm. But I'm thinking with the the baseball workout, you can keep your husband in line that way, too, because he knows that you have a good pitch for throwing things. Yes, but you have to remember, my husband is a professional athlete. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, so he kicks my butt on uh, everything. Yeah. That's a good trainer, though. Yeah, he keeps me in line. <laughs> well, so glad that you're you're back making music Thank in this you. last song. I think it's just another powerful song that we all relate to. Thank you. We have a new single coming out June 20th called My Heart Can't Tell You No, and it's the old Rod Stewart oh, yeah. pop song. Yeah. So nice. um, we're shooting a video for that on the 27th, and nice. I'm praying for a, another number one. Yes. <laughs> All right. Well, do you want to do a shot with us? Yes. What are we doing? Well, shots of questions, okay. actually. So pick your Here poison. We go. What's the biggest thing your friends make fun of you for? I am a terrible driver. Really? Like, yeah, I just, the other day I was leaving the airport and I backed into a car. I mean, I'm the worst driver because I'm so, like... I have so many other things to do besides drive. Yeah. 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 But I don't text and drive. Oh. I will say that. How about get on the phone and talk? Um, sometimes I talk on the phone, but I try, honest to God, I try to, because I will be honest with you. I was texting one day and almost got into a really bad wreck, and I vowed that I never would again. So yeah. I really try now to put my phone in the purse and put the purse in the back seat. You know? It's hard. Or I have my kids text for me. You know, I'll be like, get my phone and, and text Daddy J and tell him, ask him when he's going to be home or whatever. Well, you know? you've got seven little helpers. Yeah. <laughs> that works yeah. out. So, but um, they make fun of me for that. I'm a terrible driver. All right. Well, yeah. Sarah Evans, thank you so much for stopping thank by. Thank you very much. Good to see you.